Good morning, I'm Chelsea and this is your PHS News Today for Wednesday, October 2nd. There will be a Halloween costume dance sponsored by the PTO for any students in grades 7 through 12 that wish to participate. It will be Saturday, October 26th from 7 to 10 p.m. Cost is $5. Tickets must be purchased in advance. There will be a contest for costumes in the following categories. Scariest, most original, prettiest, and best character. All costumes must be at least knee length, have no open back, have no undergarments showing, and no real or fake weapons of any kind. Get your dollar ready. This Friday, October 4th is Hat Day. Your $1 donation will benefit the programs and the grant sponsored for the area organizations through the Orange County Community Foundation Youth Council. So check your closet and participate in Hat Day Friday, October 4th. An Indiana University representative will be here to meet with students today at 2 p.m. Any interested student seniors need to sign up in the guidance office. Additions for the fall musical Princess What's Her Name, a combination of fairy tales will be after school today. Not all sessions are required, but are helpful. Ms. Wishart recommends that you prepare a short piece to sing. There will be a fan bus for the football game this Friday night at Crawford County. The fan bus will leave at 4, 545 from the auxiliary entrance. If you ride the bus to the game, you must ride the bus home. Students who do not ride the bus home will not be allowed on the fan bus again. Herf Jones ring orders will be taken Thursday, October 3rd, Friday, October 4th during lunch. Family order night is tomorrow from 315 to 7. Don't forget to bring your down payment. If you need a ring packet, you can pick up one in the main office or the library. And now to Allie and Ben with your Ram Sports Report. Hi, I'm Allie and with me today is Ben and this is your Ram Sports Report. Last night, the JV and varsity volleyball teams faced off against Orleans. The JV team lost in two sets and the varsity team lost in four. Congratulations to the cross-country teams last night at the Jasper Invitational. The girls finished 7th as a team. Leading the way was Morgan Kingston placing 26, Lexi Strange placing 37th, Sarah Smetzer placing 38th, Kelsey Smith placing 46th, and Abby Andis placing 50th. Tristan Murphy led the pack for the boys placing 21st, Blake Roberts finished 54th, Seth Hall finished 71st, and Josh Taylor finished 74th. At yesterday's junior high cross-country meet against Orleans, the Springs Valley, Orleans and Springs Valley, the girls and boys both Place, finished first, Rachel Umpleby placed first, Casey Warren placed third, and our very own Allie Kirby placed fourth. Leading the way for the boys was Caven Tharp placing first, Ian Wilder placing second, and Travis Mefford playing third, and Josiah McCoy placing fourth. Coach Tool is so proud of her runners. Last night, the junior high volleyball team played at Mitchell. Both teams won. Back to you, Chelsea. And in junior high news, any junior high student interested in joining Junior High Drama Club should attend the meeting Friday during homeroom in Ms. Brown's room. Sign up in room 223 by Thursday. Already thinking about lunch? Here's what the cafeteria is serving up today. Looking for a forecast? Here's Trey with your weather report. Thanks, Chelsea. It looks like we've got some rain south of us today and west of us today and pretty much right on us. So, looks like we got a good chance of rain today. On to your weather today. Your humidity today will be 76% and wind speed will be southwest at 7 miles an hour. Later tonight, the sunset will be around 7.27 p.m. and the low tonight will be around 67 degrees. Over the following days, on Thursday you've got a high of 84 and a low of 61 and on Friday you've got a high of 85 and a low of 62. Back to you, Chelsea. And that's your PHS News today. Have a great day.